Hi, I'm Flick Drummond, MP for the Mian Valley, and welcome to my regular vlog. Firstly, I'd like to say a happy 100th birthday to the Honourable Colonel Tom, Captain Tom Moore. He really is an inspiration in raising 30 million for the NHS. I loved his granddaughter's comment that he made her feel as if she could be anything that she wanted to be. What a fantastic man and what a fantastic grandfather to have. Secondly, back to coronavirus. I am aware that people are becoming increasingly frustrated by the lockdown. I know how you feel, but we have five tests which you need to meet before we can move forward. Deaths falling, NHS protected, rate of infection down, the challenges of testing and PPE and avoiding a second peak. We have met or are we close to meeting the first four, but we have still have not developed a vaccine to prevent a second wave. And this is the difficult choice that the government has to take. As the Prime Minister said, we must also recognise the risk of a second spike, the risk of losing control of that virus and letting the reproduction rate go back to over one. Because that would mean not only a new wave of death and disease, but also an economic disaster. And it would be once force us all again to slam on the brakes. I'm really pleased that we've rapidly increased testing to over 800,000 people being tested and that is increasing, increasing dramatically as new testing centres are opened. Tipna in Portsmouth is our local site and ready for action. Next week there will be mobile testing centres around Hampshire and there's also home testing that you can apply for. Importantly, hospitals are open for emergency operations and working forward to opening fully. So please don't put off any of those medical issues that are causing you worry contact your GP. I'm looking forward uh, to next week which is the 75th anniversary of VE Day and there are preparations going on around the constituency. I'll be putting some of them on my website over the next few days. So please stay safe over the next week and you'll hear again from me next week.